They show animations, not just one procedure. Uh, what it is, is it's a, it's a mix of procedures, an algorithm of some sort to help patients who have paralyzed musculature in the face. So what happens is if you lose control of your face for whatever reason, be it a tumor, an accident, um, you're not able to close your eye, different parts of the face. We, we essentially do these different procedures to help optimize um, ocular safety, protection of the eye, and to optimize your ability to move your face. Now, it's not, again, like I said, it's not just one procedure. Um, the one specific reanimation procedure uh, that we talk about is, is called the masseteric facial nerve transfer. What this does is someone who's lost the ability to control their face via the normal facial nerve route, we're able to essentially take the nerve that controls the smile and plug that smile nerve into one of the other nerves that controls your ability to bite to basically reroute the electrical current. What that does is someone who's lost their function of their face is now able to smile again. When we talk about the face, you know, there's obviously, you know, upper face, mid face, lower face, right? There's different components. So if you, you can imagine if you lose function of your face, one side, um, there's multiple things we have to think about. First thing, that, first thing that comes to mind is you have to protect the eye, right? If you're not able to fully close your eye, your eye is exposed, and that, that carries significant risks, right? If your eye is exposed, you can easily get a, a, a nick on your, on your cornea, and then you can have visual loss after that. So when we talk about this series of procedures, what we need to do is we need to optimize ocular safety, protect the eye. Um, oftentimes early on, if I'm thinking the face may come back, I'll do conservative procedures to resuspend the face, basically pull it back so that it doesn't look like you're frowning on one side. And then if we know the, you know, after we do the neural EMG, so we do muscular testing to see if the nerve is gonna come back, if we know the nerve's not going to come back, then we can do these reanimation procedures where we either transfer muscle to help pull up the face, we transfer the nerve, or there are other procedures where we do something called a gracilis free flap where we take muscle from another part of the body re-innervate that muscle and connect it to the face to allow it to move. RWJ Barnabas Health. Let's be healthy together.